yo what is up what is popping back at it again with another video for y'all just want to chat with y'all express some motivation with y'all and what i want to discuss with y'all about today is this is another video about <clears throat> about the school system this is a video for like the 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 adults and we like the parents that have kids that are like in ec special education I just want to let y'all know the school system, just because like you were put in special education, it doesn't mean that you're like retarded or handicapped because, I mean, you were probably put in special education when you were in high school, but you're able to drive like you, you, you probably started driving when you were in high school and you probably had you a job in high school. But maybe you probably feel that by you, by them putting you in special education, maybe you probably feel that you were like considered retarded or mentally ill. There's nothing wrong with you. You're just the same as anybody else. The school system likes to put labels on students. You know, what I mean, yeah, you're yeah, there there's there's nothing wrong with you. The school system likes to label certain students. I mean, being in being in special education, I mean, I understand, I mean, when it comes down to EC exceptional children special education, it's mainly like just for kids that are like retarded, but not all them kids that are in EC or special education is retarded. Some of them are slow learners. You know, some of them like have dyslexia. Some of them are like autistic. You know what I mean? Everybody has a different strength. Everybody has a different weakness. Everybody has God-given abilities, but you're just the same as everyone else. You know what I mean? You know, but but I understand. And, and when you were like in special education, I mean, you probably didn't really enjoy being in them classes. You know, I mean, they probably maybe felt that like you were ADHD or ADD. But in reality, you don't you probably don't even feel that you had ADHD. You, 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 you probably just felt that you didn't really belong in school. You felt school was like wasting your time. You like like school didn't really like interest you at all. You had interest on other stuff that could make you become rich and all school was teaching you was stuff that's not even going to be valuable. But, you know, and, 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 you know, this is something this is something that you can share with your kids, your children you know, let them know that just because they're in special education does not mean that they can't be successful. They can be successful. They can beat all obstacles. They can overcome all obstacles. They can they can be whatever they want to be. They can do whatever they want to do. The school system just likes to put labels on students. The school system, it's like the school system only focuses on one learning strategy. You know, what I mean, and sometimes, you know, your your child may be in a situation where they may think about helling them back. I mean, ain't nothing. I mean, there's a lot of students that have been held back like a lot. Don't ever don't ever think that your child is all alone. Yeah, don't don't ever think that. But, yeah, I mean, everybody has a gift. Everybody has a has a weakness. You know, it's, it's it's like the school system. They only focus on one learning strategy. Not every not every student, not every child wants to be a factory worker. Not every child wants to be an engineer. Some kids want to be entertainers. Some kids want to be YouTubers. You know, you probably have a kid in school that doesn't really get a lot of recognition because of the fact they have low exam scores. They're in EC. They're in special ed. But inside of them, they have a passion for science. And, you know, like they probably like know what the actual cure can be for like a lot of these diseases. But you see, they don't really get the recognition like they should just because they have low exam scores. They deserve the same recognition like the other students do. You got some of these kids that feel like an outcast in the classroom. Yeah, yeah, no kids should feel like an outcast. I mean... And also, too, if, if you if you want to, like, consider homeschooling your kids, you know, look into it, you know, homeschool your kids, 
you know, homeschooling is better for some students because by them being in school, they were dealing with a whole bunch of distractions. They were dealing with bullying. They were dealing with getting laughed at in the classroom and everything. By them being homeschooled, they don't have to deal with a whole bunch of distractions. But yeah, just because you were in special education and just because your child is in special education, it does not mean that you cannot be successful. And it doesn't necessarily mean that that you're retarded or that your kid is retarded because you've seen your, your kid do do stuff and you know that your kid is very smart. You know that your kid is very intelligent. You know, you, you you're, you're the one that actually knows the your, your child's full potential, don't you see the school system is weird. You know, the school system is weird. The school system always likes to label students and, 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 and teachers pretty much know this stuff too. like teachers know that by that by them teaching them this stuff that they're not going to use it in their real life. Teachers know that it's a waste of time. It's a waste of the students time and it's a waste of their time too. teachers always saying that kids need school to become successful, but teachers are not even successful their own. So you got school teachers out here that are like broke as fuck. But yeah, I just wanted to chat with y'all, spread some motivation with y'all to let y'all know that if you were in special education in school, it doesn't mean that you're retarded. And just because your kid is in special education, it doesn't mean that they're retarded either. I mean, they say it's mainly for kids that are retarded, but there's, there's other, there's many different learning disabilities. The school system always likes to label students don't forget that also don't forget like subscribe hit the notification bell on my channel comment share love y'all